Greetings all praise the king. So this video is something that was uploaded last month. It's a series of phone calls in regards to the vaccine and the passport. Um, and it was uh, rejected from YouTube. We were told it was inappropriate content. So we're making this video here uh, to show people uh, what these folks think is inappropriate content. passports and the idea that you should only be able you should not maybe be able to fly or not be able to go on a cruise or go to a concert unless you can show proof of a vaccine oh god yes because to me it's common sense hey thanks for the show you just brought up something i wasn't even thinking about when you said that the sandus is more worried about the cruise ships going somewhere else than here once again another example of profit over people that i see a lot with the conservative ideology but uh, going back to whether or not businesses can require a vaccine, quote, passport, unquote, I think businesses should be allowed to do whatever they want to do. The COVID shot is not a vaccine, but an experimental gene therapy, which is not FDA approved. Forced experimental medical therapies are in violation of the Nuremberg codes. Anyone taking the shot now is part of the clinical trials. So Donna, very interesting point that it is, you know, in some ways being forced to um, inject your body with, um, uh, you know, inject your body, participate in, a, in a, a medical experiment. We don't know what the really long-term impacts are, um, uh, yeah. and we'll find out. But the more people don't get a vaccine, go out in society, spread, continue to spread this disease, the more everyone is at risk. You know, it's my choice. Why do I have to go down the interstate and not go more than 70 miles an hour? Why isn't it my choice, my choice, to go 100 miles an hour? Yes, and, and seatbelts and smoking and and no smoking in, in any place, indoors, all well, those Well, I think what Randy was saying is other things that actually do affect other people. So not yeah, seatbelts. Everybody, that's but why you can't speeding, go 100 yeah. miles on the interstate is because you're likely to kill somebody. Mm -hmm. And why should I say, uh, I should, I can't have a uh, vaccine passport. Why should I have a driver's license? Well, what I'm talking about is that those semi-crazies who who are, have this position about against vaccines and so forth. Right. Now, I think that's ridiculous. The vaccine uh, helps your immune system to get stronger. It has a response to the vaccine, and it builds your immune system. So it, getting the vaccine does help your immune system get stronger. I think we have time for one more call, and we have um, Lisa in Winter Haven. Lisa, you'll be our last call of the day. Um, what do you think is more effective, body, natural immune response, this doesn't sound like Lisa. Yes. Okay. And that's uh, my wife. Uh, okay. Do you like to hear to ask the question? No, go ahead. That's uh, fine. Some Just... people that have already had the virus. You know, my question is, what do you think better, natural body response or, or the pharmaceuticals? Well, you know, you raise an interesting point, point not Lisa, Mr. Lisa, because um, you raise a very interesting point because I read an article yesterday that said that there was a study uh, that showed that people who have had COVID, who actually had COVID and recovered, are basically in the same status as somebody who never had COVID and got a vaccination. So those people who had COVID and recovered may not need to be vaccinated. They may want to go on a cruise, but they're not going to have any proof of vaccination. That seems well, that's why would you discriminate against people that have been more effective, uh, effective uh, at eliminating the, the uh, virus? You know, this, yeah, this, well, this, I see this, your this, point this, on that. I think, I think you not agree that this isn't going to go away. You know, when, when they say Corona's gone, it will be another virus. Yeah, yeah, it's mutating. It, we're going to have to be it's dealing with it. Uh, yeah. It's going to gonna continue to evolve to another stage. Uh, and, you know, people are going to have to stand up. You know, we do have rights when a man decides to give them to us or not. Yeah. So, Thanks you know, for the call. We appreciate it. We
we got, we're running out of time, and we do have Amy who wants to follow up because we talked about her a little bit. So Amy, we're, I'm gonna put you on, but we have, you got 30 seconds. 30 seconds, Amy, what's your, um, you wanna reply to what we, we talked about you a little bit after you hung up, so 30 yeah. seconds. Thank you, people can say that it's ludicrous to compare, you know, abortion to sickness. However, it's my right to choose how I want to heal my body. I mean, you know what? I had a doctor that wanted to put a, a, a steroidal ointment to stop an itch on my arm. I found out later that I was allergic to chicory roots. I, I would, all I had to do was stop eating chicory roots, and I wouldn't have that itch on my arm. It's my right to choose how I want to treat my body. Yeah. That's my point. Okay. okay. We got to right. Thank you. Sorry. Thank you. All right. Thank you. So we have just a minute. Thank you. Thank you. So we have, just in the last um, 30 seconds here, we can read a couple, maybe read a couple more emails. We've got a lot of emails here. Um, uh, let me pull one up, and now all of a sudden, Shelly, you see one because my, um, let's see, oh, that one, we got, here's a text message, what did they say? Um, they not agree that this isn't going to go away. You know, when, when they say Corona's gone, it will be another virus. Yeah, yeah, it's mutating. And we're going to have to be dealing with it. Uh, yeah, it's going to continue. Uh, if you need to leave it on your to go on to another stage. Uh, and, you know, people are going to have to stand up. You know, we do have rights when a man decides to give them to us or not. Really crazy. Have the only video from my recollection uh, that was rejected for inappropriate content on YouTube. <laughs>